what I did for this present government in 2020. Politics is all, it's all about interest. Don't be deceived. And every human being have time for for his peak. And in 2020 was my peak. And I've been there for years. I've never had my identity for one day. I was a bus conductor in this town. I drove bus for two years in this town. When I was driving the bus, I was still going to school. I might not have the opportunity that so many of you had. But my father was not poor. My father was a rich man. The polygamous own. My father got married to about nine wives. And my mother happened to be number fifth or number six. And those people that know my father know that my father was very wealthy. You know, polygamous own. So, and I'm the first son of my mom. That's why I started struggling and hustling. At the age of 23, I bought my first car. I was in my 30 when I bought my first house. I've been a hustler. That's why I look at some, some idiots, some lunatic, some social media element when they are when they were saying they were the one that brought me out. I was the chairman of driver welfare. No, I started as the vice chairman of driver welfare, Ring Road Ogida, in 2003 when Lucky Benito was the governor. I was the youngest vice chairman in Edo State. In 2003, when Lucky Benito was the governor. In 2006 or 2005, I became a chairman of a park. Are you getting it? In 2005. So, at the time, I became the discipline officer of a State Driver's Welfare. I've been there for a very long time. But I'm one person, I'm not loud. But you should allow your success to speak for you. You should allow your good name to speak for you. I, I don't know if you understand. Amen. Omega, honor, 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 rise. So I want to let you people know that the way this present government treat me was wrong, was bad. You people can testify to you for what I did in 2020. But I've never come out one day on social media to insult or to disagree with the policy of this present government. I kept news. I'm not part of those people who in one reason or another will come out on social media to start insulting the government because of their personal interest or their selfish interest. I've never done that. I was not brought up that way. That's why I kept mute. But what God has blessed me with and what people are